This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar taking a closer look at the color page in DaVinci Resolve with an emphasis on its unique tools. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this excerpt, I'll demonstrate how to use nodes to solve more complex problems in color grading. Nodes allow us to add multiple effects to the same clip, not using stacks of effects like we do in Premiere and Final Cut, but by using connected control spots for each effect. Let me show you how nodes work. I'm going to show nodes. Every clip always has one node. Remember the shortcut we started at the beginning, which is keyboard shortcut tab? That allows me to name each node. So we're going to name this normal. If I control click on the node and say add node serial, it adds a connected node. The green is the RGB signal. The blue is the selection mask. So here I'm going to hit the tab key and name this one, we're going to call it brightness. And so that with that node selected, I'll go to the color wheel, pull the gain up, and we've got it bright. Control click and add a node. Serial. Keyboard shortcut is Option S. Tab. And we're going to say balloon. Okay. And with the balloon, I'm going to use the selection and drag across here to select it. Show the highlight so I can see what's going on. We've been down this road. We'll just make this a little bit better. Right about there. Close enough. And now we're going to change the color using the HDR mix and just change that to green. Okay, so that's the balloon. Now I'm going to control click on this and I'm going to add a node which is the outside. Here with the outside, it's already been bright, so I've got the bright here. I've already got the balloon isolated, so that's the balloon. Now what I want to do is I want to decrease the, the level of the background and desaturate it to make that balloon pop and go to this icon here and add some blur. There we go. So I added some blur. I added decreased saturation and I decreased the gain and now when I turn the highlights off, there's our finished effect. That's the power of nodes. Let's try something a little bit more exciting. This shot right here. And we're going to hit the tab key. And this is our starting spot. We're going to call this normal. And then type the keyboard shortcut Option S, which creates another serial uh, node. And we're going to adjust the levels. And then set this and go to, she's a little bit dark. We'll just pull the gain up right about there. Now that already looks much better. Look at us, please. Thank you. Looks much better, but wouldn't it be cool if we could give it a bit more of a dramatic effect? You know, more of a, a film noir look. That'd be kind of nice. So let's create a new node. Control, click, add a node. Serial, which means one that follows, and we're going to call this eyes. With the eye node selected, we'll go to the power window. We'll add a rectangular power window. Adjust the tilt because why not? Make it smaller because I want to focus on her eyes. Add a lot of feathering. Make it smaller yet. Good. Okay, so now I've got her eyes. Then I'm going to create one more, control click, and I'm going to add a node which is outside, which is everything except her eyes. So here is the eyes node right there, and here is everything except the eyes node. And if I make an adjustment to this node, it changes in the node that follows. Now, with the node here, I'll go back to this and pull the gain way down. 
And we'll pull the mids down. Right about there. And now we'll turn highlights off. And we'll hide the power window. And look at what we've got here. Now I'll pull the gain up a bit. Pull the saturation up a bit. Go to here. There we go. This is what it looked like before. That was our starting shot. And this is what it looks like now. Is that amazing? That's what nodes allow you to do. To add multiple effects to the same clip to be able to achieve effects that you could not achieve any other way. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar taking a closer look at the color page in DaVinci Resolve. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at LarryJordan.com store and look for Webinar 328. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's almost 2,000 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers a variety of software, and we update it multiple times each month. For more information, visit LarryJordan.com membership. And thanks.